Hi, this is Chris, and I'm going to show you how to use my radius calculator to cut a curved arch for any purpose. Mark a line on your piece where you want the highest point of the arch. Mine is symmetric, so I mark the center of this 20-inch board. Now determine how wide you want your arch to be. I was using fluted trim along the sides, so I decided my arch would be 15 inches. Next, decide how high you want the arch to rise. I wanted a subtle arch, so I used 1 inch. Now go to my radius calculator webpage and enter the height and width into the calculator. When I entered a height of 1 inch and a width of 15 inches, the radius was calculated as 28 and 5 eighths inches. Note this calculator also works with metric values the same as it does with inches. Make a loop on the end of a string and put a pencil through it at the top of your arch. Now use anything square to ensure you stay perpendicular to the wood and hold down the string at the calculated radius. Then pivot the pencil back and forth to draw the curved line of the arch. Double check the layout to ensure the arch is the right size and placement. Clamp the piece to a workbench and cut along the line with a jigsaw. For the long arch above the bridge, I use this same arch that I just cut as a template to mark each end. Then I used a straight edge to connect the two. Next, I clamped that big piece to the bench and cut it the same way. I sanded all the pieces with a random orbit sander before painting them to match the cabinets. Finally, I installed the arches with caulk and my pneumatic brad nailer. And that's how I cut the arches for the bed bridge bookcase. Visit my website handydad.tv for more great ideas and subscribe to be the first to know when new videos are posted.